All right. So how many apps do you need when it comes to financial, you know, investing, uh, the things that we do? Well, uh, CCI, the number one app you see we have on our screen is uh, our CCI app where, you know, we get empowering information and videos. Uh, Trust Wallet, uh, the coin uh, app, which allows us to generate uh, tokens as we drive around. Uh, Robinhood, of course, Thinkorswim, Webull, uh, Binance uh, USA, because we're in the U.S., uh, you know, our in other wallets based on uh, tokens that we have, uh, Pi, which we're also generating Pi, uh, crypto, uh, one of the um, coolest ways to, you know, purchase uh, cryptocurrency on a regular basis. And also, if you look, we have, you know, DeFi wallets and other things. Uh, Nexo, where we are uh, able to uh, borrow against our currencies. TronLink, of course, where we, you know, use this DAP in order to generate uh, other tokens within, you know, that ecosystem. And uh, in general, you know, we focus on these apps because they all serve a different function. Uh, but in this video section, what I'm going to start doing is sharing with you how to, um, you know, use these apps over time to, uh, you know, get your investing on directly from your phone. So it's really cool, right? Uh, but this video, just wanted to share with you some of the stuff I have, um, like yeah, Yahoo Finance and Bloomberg, you know, for my news, um, which a lot of um, using news in order to gauge uh, certain investments and what's going on. And, um, you know, kind of like buy the rumor, sell the news uh, also helps uh, with that. And a lot of the different things, you know, maintaining um, just an understanding of the market at all times, right? And uh, these upgrades are pretty uh, cool when you look at it. So we're able to get the news, see what's happening, and kind of um, continue on that path to empowering ourselves with exactly uh, what we need in the time that we need it, right? So it's timely. The news Yahoo Finance, uh, I'm actually going to make a video and show you how I use that uh, or how you can use it rather to discover a stock that you can invest in ahead of time. All right. Uh, so hope you enjoy this video. I'll uh, see you in a next video. And this will be, like I said, a series. So we'll create a playlist where we'll just, you know, focus on apps and uh, using apps, um, you know, and, and the funny thing about apps, like you could start with uh, ten ten dollars on, on crypto or you know any app you can start with a hundred you know so it doesn't um, matter how much you have and start with you can definitely you know start where you are and build over time and and that, to be honest dollar cost averaging is really an amazing uh, formula and method for investing for someone who doesn't have a huge bag to you know just uh, throw into and even if you have a huge bag it's also a good way to get stocks um, and other investments at a, at a pretty good price when you get more when the market's lower, right? And yeah, you might pay whatever when the market's higher, but you're constantly investing. So over time, that definitely grows and can benefit you in the long run. All right. So yeah, uh, this is the investor guy. Hope you enjoy this video. Uh, it's the first of a series of videos where we showcase uh, what we are doing within apps. Um, okay. 